I'm sure this is going to get a lot of people excited when it comes to DC Universe movies. No, I'm not talking about Michael Keaton returning to play Batman in the Flash movie. No, I'm, of course, talking about Queen Mira getting her own spinoff movie. Actually, let me walk that back. Not a movie, an HBO Max series. I don't know who's making these decisions at Warner, but they clearly are pretty blind to everything that's going on right now. Uh, They don't seem to care that there's a petition that's almost at 2 million signatures to have her removed from Aquaman 2. Uh, They actually think that this is a bunch of bots and fake, you know. They always cite Captain Marvel, which I find absolutely hilarious. Why do I find that hilarious? Because, well, Captain Marvel was sandwiched between the two biggest movies of the decade, that being Avengers Infinity War and Endgame. I mean, I don't even think that movie would have been as big as it was if it wouldn't have been sandwiched. But, you know, what do I know? I, I, I could be wrong on that. And if I am, I'll admit that. But. This is a little bit different. (laughs) People don't like Amber Heard. And it's for good reasons. Everything that's happened with JD. And, you know, there's been a lot of stuff. She's been caught in all kinds of lies. Particularly when she said, well, no one's going to believe you, Johnny, because you're a man. And all the shenanigans that happened in England. I'm not going to get too much into that. But it's not just this. We can head over to Amber Heard's 2020 takeaway video that she did for Access. Uh, that's now cert- that's now sitting at 432,000 dislikes. You can't really ignore these things, Warner. But they are. They think it's a bunch of bots and trolls, and they're very much underestimating, I think. <laughs> I, I think they're really underestimating how disliked she is. I could see a lot of people canceling their subscription over HBO Max. Or I don't know. But that might be a long shot, but I really don't think there's going to be a big demand for this. A lot of the rumors have said that they're going to double down on her. There was a rumor on this spinoff series before. Uh, There's been a rumor that she's going to be just as big as Wonder Woman, that they want to make her as big as Wonder Woman, which I think is absolutely hilarious. Uh, She's no Gal Gadot. Let me tell you that right now. So let's go over this a little bit. It's claimed that Amber Heard is getting her own HBO Max series for Mira, which will spin off from the Aquaman movies. YouTuber Grace Randolph claims the rumor is true and says the Mira HBO Max series will mostly take place on land. Randolph previously said that Amber Heard's role in Aquaman 2 will be drastically reduced, said to be because of the controversy involving JD, with Randolph offering the Mira series will explain why Mira isn't a big part of the sequel. Grace Randolph can be hit or miss. I think this is true. I really do. Uh, And the reason I think this is true is partially because of the fact that if you didn't know this, Amber just got off of a bunch of reshoots for Justice League. She's going to be apparently a big part. Well, at least she's going to have a much bigger part in the Justice League Snyder Cut. She's going to be on some nightmare Justice League team, and she's going to have a big scene with Arthur. That's what I've read. Whether or not that turns out to be true or not, I don't know, but it's undeniable. She was there doing reshoots. That's when she came out and was like, I love nerds and all this stuff. It was really cringy. Uh, I think this is true, and I think that they really do want to push her up and make her the next Wonder Woman uh, because, well... She's got the part already. She's a young, pretty actress, and they think that that will sell subscriptions. If you want to just get down to it, she's convinced them that all of this is bogus and that she's going to redeem herself, which I really don't see happening. And uh, comic book stuff is all the rage, and they think this will sell subscriptions. Uh, I think it's a big mistake, and I think they're asking for a big sales slump with this, but, you know... I just, I don't don't know. I don't make these decisions. I just think this is true. I could be wrong. I hope I am wrong. I like her to be removed completely from the movie and never a part of another comic book movie again, because I don't like many of you. I don't like her, but I do believe that she's getting this show 
It's just my opinion. Uh, hopefully I'm wrong. But yeah, Amber Heard sticking around. And then they go on to talk about her being in reshoots and stuff like that. And the rest is mostly a, clo- a quote from her. Uh, but yes, Randolph is hit or miss on some things. I think that she's likely right on this one. And what a stupid move to not just give her a movie part. They're giving her a, a series. So everyone that was jumping for joy that she was getting her part reduced, this apparently this Mira spinoff show is going to explain why. So not only is she going to be in Aquaman 2, because she's still going to be in, and even with a reduced part, she's getting her own show. So, you know, Warner doubling down on AH and continuing to give JD the finger. Though I do think at the end of it all, he's going to get the last laugh. I do think his his career will probably rebound a little bit through indie movies. And then when all of this dies down after the next trial, it's going to be a while too. Because apparently there is another trial that's going to involve her suing him. And I don't know if this is going to play, take place at the same time or after the suit he's ha- he's got on her in Virginia. I don't know. It's getting all so complicated. I've been reading through this. This just dropped today. I'm still kind of going through it. But... This is going to be an ugly legal mess for a long time, probably for another two years. So I don't know where this is going to go, but apparently Warner Brothers, uh, they think we're all a bunch of bots. You know, she doesn't really have anybody that doesn't like her, despite evidence that says the contrary. So I, I don't know, man. What a weird, what a weird mess this has all been. Anyway, that's it, guys. Let me know what you think about all this. I'd like to hear your thoughts also. Leave a comment, like, share the video. Make sure you're still subscribed. Hit that notification bell, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace. Also, if you want to help support the channel, check out my Teespring store. There's a link in the description. You can find some merchandise in there that you might want to check out.